In today's video, we're opening the brand new Light of Destruction 2024 reprint. What's up guys, we are back with another epic opening. In this one, we will be opening a Light of Destruction booster box. So normally on these new sets, I open a couple boxes. Here's the thing, it has been a major pain to get hold of these. And I know a lot of you guys are thinking the same thing. If you're from the USA like me, these did not release in the US. If you missed my video when these were first announced, this is a Euro only product. So getting your hands on this is a major, major pain. I have a Whatnot stream tonight at 5 p.m. You guys will see the ad in just a minute. This video is sponsored by Whatnot. Whatnot is one of my favorite places to stream. We do tons of streams over there and we're gonna be doing one this Thursday at 5 p.m. Central, opening the brand new Light of Destruction reprint set. Now this set is really hard to come by because it's from over in Europe. I've had trouble myself getting it. So if you wanna grab some yourself and potentially win some booster boxes, make sure you come to my stream this Thursday and don't forget to use your $15 free credit if you're a new user. Click the link down below to get that. And not only will you get free credit and get to watch some awesome packs be opened, but you can also win giveaways of the new set and many more. Go watch the stream, go win a giveaway, go check out the buy it now. It's going to be super, super fun. We want to see more of you guys over on the whatnot stream. So click the link down below, get $15 free credit. Make sure you come try to win a giveaway, watch some packs be open. Hopefully we'll pull that ghost rare honest. Thanks again to whatnot for sponsoring this video. So I've been trying to get these here for today and they just arrived literally like five and a half hours before the stream. So fortunately they showed up today, but uh, we also need to record some videos. So I don't have all the boxes I'm going to be getting. I don't have as many boxes to open at this moment. So we're just going to be opening the one box. So if you're frustrated, you're like, ah, oh, it's so annoying to have, it's Euro only, don't worry. Sassy Auto has some available down below. So get 5% off using my discount code. Order from Sassy Auto. He has them in the States. So you'll be able to order some. He doesn't have as much as he normally has for other things, but he does have a bunch of boxes. So go check those out. Use the 5% discount code. We also have pre-sales for the Mega Tins coming up, which actually have some pretty good reprints like SP and they have these uh, Blue Eyes White Dragon SDK art and QCR. That's going to be pretty exciting. So go check those out. Use my codes. It's an affiliate link. Thank you guys for doing that. And today's giveaway will be every card we pull in this video. Just like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, and let me know down below. What do you think about this new set? How do you think it looks? Are you happy they did it? Do you think they shouldn't have done it? Just let me know all your thoughts in the comments. Also, I want to shout out Hidalgo PD, or he also has a website called Olympus Collectibles. He sent me three of these boxes for the this, the stream tonight, so I really appreciate it. So huge shout out to him for getting me these ASAP. Let's get into this opening. Uh, we've been chatted enough, guys. Make sure to subscribe to the channel, of course, because we are almost at 250K. We'll be opening every pack ever made. I guess I need to keep one of these reprint packs, too, even though it's technically the same set. Uh, not from this opening. We'll do it later when I have more packs. But OK, so it's definitely a Euro product. You can see how much space there is in the box that happens with the Euro products. They have like more of the the boxes are more like uh, they, they could, like they're perforated. Yeah, that's the word. So you can they could like break down the sides. Kind of interesting. All right, how do these feel? Let's get our first impression. Unfortunately, we're probably, I mean, here's the thing. We might pull the honest, we might not. Uh, so we won't be able to compare it like to old ghosts unless we actually get it. But if we don't pull it today, we'll be pulling it on the live stream that I'm planning for on Saturday. So we're probably gonna do, all right, the schedule I talked about in the video, it's changing. We're doing the big stream on Friday instead of Saturday. So what we're gonna do is, Tonight is gonna to be the whatnot stream on Thursday. Instead of another video of light instruction, we're just gonna be doing the big stream tomorrow on Friday. So keep an eye out for tomorrow's stream. It'll probably start at 1 p.m. Central, something like that. We're gonna be opening up a bunch of the boxes, so it should be a ton of fun. So check out the YouTube stream tomorrow. I wanted to make sure you guys knew the right date. All right, let's get into it. If you guys wanna grab some tonight or be part of the giveaways, make sure you come to the whatnot stream. That's gonna be super fun. All right, let's just see how these things look. Let's see how they look. Let's see how the cards. I've seen some things about them. I don't know the pack trick. I'm just going to do three and see what happens. Uh, we have Tour of Doom. Okay, so these look pretty like new cards for the most part, from what I can tell. D Fortune. Were these supposed to be new or the old style? I can't remember. These definitely are Euro. You can tell because Euro tend to have like little dots all over the cards on the surface. I don't really know what it is. Just how they print it, I guess. Uh, the Arcana Force 4. We are recording. That's good. Hero Mask. We don't have boxes to waste. Gladiator Lash. Arcana Force 3. Deck lockdown, baby. Deck lock. All right. Short circuit. All right. So that is no foil there. I think three from the back will be correct because you should get a rare and you should get a foil in here. One box being opened up today. More opened up tomorrow and tonight. And then we're going to do a big stream Saturday. I'm very excited for that. Battery Man Microcell. Uh, I don't think it's a guaranteed ulti in every box. There are ultis, there are secrets, and there's a ghost rare in here. The honest, obviously. Um, so 
Oh, there we go. Our first foil. So three from the back. Oh, it replaces the rare. Interesting. Okay, so it replaces the rare. Wait, I don't even know if original light is structured to replace the rare. That's kind of weird. Okay, Arcus Light Sworn Druid. That's okay. That's not a horrible card. It's a Light Sworn card. Uh, the foil. You know, this doesn't look anything like the original, and I think that that is a really good thing. So the thing is, like, if they make it look exactly like the original, it's really hard for the average person slash even, I mean, really, a lot of people can't tell the difference between, like, the 2017 reprints and the originals for the LOB and everything like that. So, and that is kind of a major problem because on TCG Player, the listings are not separated. So it's, like, all kind of, gr like, glump, glump together, like, grumped, grump together, clump together. <laughs> Wow, look guys, it's been a crazy week trying to get all the stuff here, okay? So it, they're all grouped together, I should say. And then you'll buy like a $2 LOB Maneater Bug and you might get an original or you might get a 2017 reprint, 2010 reprint, you really don't know. And then the thing is that's because the sellers have no idea and there's not a way to differentiate on TCG. I have not looked, but I think that on TCG, I'm pretty sure they gave Light of Destruction their own little section, which is a really good thing. Froggy Force Field, there you go, SDF. That is a really, really good thing because then those are kind of in their own area. So if you wanna buy a 2024 reprint, you know you're buying a 2024 reprint. You're not like doing the you know, the lottery of what you're gonna get. The cool part about that is if you buy on TCG Player, you could buy like a cheap version of a card and it ends up being an original. That can happen. So that's a little hack for you guys if you wanna try to you know, play the TCG player lottery. It doesn't usually work. We might try that uh, for our next investment next year. Just buy a bunch of really cheap old school cards and hope that they're original prints. Or gain of force, we have the uh, Gladiator Lash. Though I don't know how we'd keep up with that. Oh, there we go. <laughs> okay, that'll do it. Solar Recharge, ultimate rare. Okay, let's take a look at this ulti. So this obviously, I wish I had a Solar Recharge ulti. I think I sold mine, but yeah, this obviously does not look like the old school. Let's try to pop up the old school. The pictures just don't do ultis justice, so I don't know how close it's gonna be, but this definitely looks a lot more like, it looks like an OTS without the OTS border to me. That's what the texture looks like. I will say though, it looks pretty good. It looks it looks different, that's for sure. I don't know, it's definitely gonna be a matter of opinion. I can see people saying this looks terrible, I can see people liking it. It will be differentiated, I think, on TCG Player. I'm pretty sure they differentiated it. So you'll know what you're getting. Like, if you really like this kind of foil, you can buy it on that specific spot. Or uh, you could not buy it on that specific spot, depending on what you think. That is a really nice ultimate rare. Okay. Light of Destruction. Ultimate rare has been pulled. I mean, Judgment Dragon's in here. We've pulled one recently in first edition. So, oh, it is four from the back, by the way. We figured that out. Limit Reverse. Let's see what we can get. We have the uh, Garganeth. Golden Bamboo Sword, the Arcane Force through the Empress, Space Gift, Arcane Force 1, where's the Fool, and Demise of the Land, and a Substitute, okay, that's a, that's a pretty good pack right there, both good cards, Substitute just recently got a reprint, plus it has the rares, so I think the price of that is not going to be as crazy as it once was, it was a $30 rare in first edition at one point, which is pretty crazy, Demise of the Land was also like an $8 common at one point, Goblin Recon Squad, we have Lucky Chance, Dice Try, the Cross Porter, this Nero Dread Servant, and Hero Blast, pretty cool card, Hero Blast. So basically with this one, you get to uh, add a elemental hero from your graveyard and then pop a card on the field with attack or le less than or equal to, which is pretty cool actually. All right, there was another, there was something I was gonna say that, that Hero Blast distracted me and now I can't remember what it was. That's happened twice in this video. I don't know what's going on, that's not a good sign. I'm forgetting everything. I already have a terrible memory, guys. It's really bad. I have to use the notes app. I'm t typing everything in there. If I don't put it in there, you might as well expect me to not remember. It's it's kind of bad. It's it's kind of bad. Light destruction. Reprint set. So far, you know, it's pretty cool. I think it's pretty cool. I'm glad it's a lot different. I'm glad it's a lot different. Kind of reminds me of like a Korean opening. I don't know why. Maybe it's because European is just a little different. Maybe that's what it is. We have the Volcanic Queen. There it is. Can of Force 6, uh, Raging Cloudy. And a battery man industrial strength. Very nice rare. We'll take it. All right. All right. Light of destruction. So far, you have given us a pretty sick ultimate rare. What can you give us now? Battery man charger. If you guys like battery man or light swarm, this is your set. We have arcana call or the weird arcana card. Not arcana, but the uh, arcana force. Sorry. We have spell gear and. Oh, Helios Trice Magistus. I forgot this was in here as a super rare. I have not opened a lot of light destruction over the years, so. 
This is a set I'm not super familiar with, so this will definitely help me become more familiar with it. Also, if you're wondering about Wield Goat, that's what I forgot. Wield Goat uh, normally would be on Friday, but because of all the new release and everything, it's probably going to be on Sunday. So that's going to get pushed back a little bit. This, this week is with MBT. If you guys have not seen uh, Wield Goat, there's Cup of Ace. There you go. There you go, Ian. Cup of Ace. We have the uh, Raging Cloudian cross border. And we have a light barrier. But yeah, if you have not seen the other uh, Wheeled Goat episodes, I know a lot of you guys missed the one with Danny. It, it's like got like half the views of the other ones. So go check that out if you haven't seen it. It was actually a pretty funny episode. Uh, definitely some funny decks were played uh, <laughs> specifically. So go check it out. It's been fun. The other episodes, if you have missed those, we have Team Samurai on there. We have Simo. We have Rhyme Style. We have Distant Coder. So go check all them out. We have Summon Limit. Nice card. Uh, Lucky Chance and... Owner Seal with the Lava Golem. Very nice. Okay, halfway through so far. Def I, li I like that they don't look like old school cards. I think that's a good thing. Uh, overall, I'm I think this is pretty cool. I want to see the Ghost Rare. I don't have high hopes for the Ghost Rare because the Ghost Rares recently have not looked great. I kind of want to do a video about that. Arcane of Force 4. And the glorious illusion. But uh, yeah, I'm going to have to see it for myself first before I make a judgment. Maybe we'll pull it tonight on whatnot. So make sure you guys are there at 5 p.m. I know this is going to be at like probably not three when it releases. So only a couple hours from now is the whatnot stream. Because I'm recording this day of. I didn't get it till the day of, you know, so I couldn't record early. Uh, Lady in white. So if you want to be there, make sure you go uh, click that link down below. Get $15 free credit. Oh, and shout out to Whatnot for helping us pull. This is one of the better secret rares in the set. This is uh, really nice. Light of Destruction, secret rare. This is an Edison card. Neither player can special summon monsters. Another cool part is when it flips face up, destroy all special summon monsters. That kind of goes off in Edison sometimes because they, they're not expecting you to set Fossil Dino a lot of the time. I actually main decked it in a, in a few uh, few times in my Edison tournaments and people are like, whoa, they were not expecting it. So it kind of goes off when uh, it actually works. Okay, so we've gotten a secret and an ultimate. I'm guessing you're not going to get a ghost, but I'm not 100% sure. With that, Light Spiral. This is a pretty good giveaway, guys. <laughs> you guys are going to have a pretty good box. Cup of Ace, Lucky Chance, Gladiator Lash, and Dark Valkyria Gemini action. Look at that. Yep, even the Euro print quality. Sometimes it comes through and it's not great. Okay, let's keep it going. Let's finish up this recording so we can get this video out to you guys. Don't forget to subscribe. We are less than 9K away from every pack opening. That's going to be so exciting. Wetlands summons limit. I'm very excited for that video. Destiny Dread Servant. And I have ideas. Divine Knight is Shark. Okay. Any monster that destroys this card by battles removed from play. Hmm. Interesting. But I have some ideas for the full week. I think the full week's going to be insane. I'm very pumped. It's going to be very good. One, two, three, four from the back. Level tuning, limit reverse. We have reversal of fate. Arcana call. Rux is special. Sanguine Swamp. Miracle Flipper, Arcane of Force 18, the Moon, Demise of Land, and Genzo Returner. He returns for more. Genzo. Let's keep it going. Did you guys know? We actually found this out on Twitch the other day. That you know Genzo and he has the Amplifier Equip card from Ancient Sanctuary? Did you know that in that card it actually reads, if that if Amplifier is destroyed, Genzo was also destroyed. So you give Genzo an Amplifier like an Equip card. It's like giving him an Axe of Despair. And then when Axe of Despair is destroyed, he dies. It's so weird. There's Golden Ladybug. That's a rare. That used to be like a 3 or $4 rare. Probably not anymore. But like, it's so weird. It's like you now give him another way to be outed. All it, it's not that, that all it does, because it does allow you to use trap cards when Genzo's on the field, which is pretty crazy. But it's like, wow, that is, uh, it's kind of rough. Because <laughs> now Genzo's destroyed. We have a uh, Hero Mask, Arf Arcane Force 1, the Magician, Arcane Force 7, the Chariot, Space Gift. And Arcana Force, 14 Temperance. That was a hand trap used in Duel Links for a little bit. Still have about maybe five, six packs left. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed the video so far. We'll be doing another video tomorrow and then a live stream Saturday and a live stream tonight. So a lot of Light of Destruction reprint set on the horizon. Hopefully you guys are excited to see it. Deformation, I know we got ours a little late. There we go. Arcana Force, Zero the Fool. Very nice. And Vanquishing Light, super rare. Tribute one lights from a monster and negate the summon of a monster and destroy it. E, that's kind of horrible. That's a Horn of Heaven, but you have to tribute a Light Sworn. Oh my gosh, that's terrible. Does Horn of Heaven only say normal summon or flip summon? Maybe that's what it is, because it's maybe that's because it has specials as well. I'm not sure, but that's kind of horrible. <laughs> you trade that card plus a tribute to stop one summon. That is not great. Rainbow Gravity, we have Sanguine Swamp. That's why nobody plays it, I guess. Arcana Force, 18 the Moon. Cup of Ace, Demise of the Land. 
and a dangerous machine type six. During each of your standby phases, roll a six sided die. Roll a one, discard one card. Roll a two, your opponent discards one card. Roll a three, draw one card. Roll a four, your opponent draws one card. Roll a five, destroy one monster in your opponent controls. And roll a six, destroy this card. That's a continuous spell. You just keep doing that over and over. That sounds pretty dangerous for sure. Feels like we pulled a lot of foils in this opening. I think you get quite a bit out of Light Destruction. We have the, uh, let's see what we can get now. Can we get another high rarity card? That'd be pretty crazy. Wetlands, Sanguine Swamp. We have Volcanic Queen. Nice try, buddy. We have the Portable Battery Pack. And Smorg, Bird of Ancestry. Okay, down to three packs left. I like the way these feel, actually. They feel kind of cool. I think that might just be the Euro Pack thing. Uh, but guess what? There's only a Euro print because uh, we didn't get it. We got the old structure deck, Realm of Light. How exciting. Uh, short circuit, we have the Quick Charger, Limit Reverse, Destiny Hero, Miracle Flipper, Spell, Gear. Okay, Lucky Chair, Lucky what? Lucky Chance. Okay, Lumina, that is a rare. Nice card, Lumina. Also, if you guys want to support the channel, make sure you check out Ruxin34.com. We got a lot of things available over there. My TCG Player Store is also on as well if you want to buy a little bit cheaper cards for the most part. Uh, like lower, lower rarity, lower end, stuff like that. Arcade of Force Zero, the Fool. We have Arcade of Force One, the Magician. Oh, you get two Ultras. Destiny and Dragoon. Okay. That's two Ultras, an Ulti, a Secret, and then a few Supers as well. So, wow, we are getting a lot of foils. Last pack magic, guys. If you guys have enjoyed this video, don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more content. And do not forget Whatnot tonight at 5 p.m. Central. If you just want to watch the stream, if you just want to win giveaways, that will be tonight. It's going to be amazing. Let's go. Let's pull something awesome. We have Battery Man Charger, Reversal of Fate, Dice Try, Ruxin Special, Arcade Force Zero, The Fool, Cross Porter, Volcanic Queen, and a Ryko Light Sworn Hunter ending it off with an Edison Banger. What a sweet, sweet set. I'm actually pretty excited about this. It's kind of weird, but it is pretty exciting. I like, I like the way they've done it. So let me know your thoughts in the comments. Shout out to Tone Fo Show, Anesta Deanna, America Deutscher, Brandon Chaney, Ian Musa Jr. Barding, Robert F. Changelang, and Aldelsa Garcia Jr. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.